I promise I have the worst luck ever. Remember when I said there was nothing else wrong with the car? I didn't start the car. So that's why those lights are just there. I promise. There's nothing else wrong with the car. I promise. Yeah, I lied. So apparently the starter went out. And I'm gonna show you how easy it is to change that in the Mazda Speed 3. Pretty much have this uh, if you have a front mount set up anyways. It's a lot easier. You can get it from the bottom, you can get it from the top. The easiest, in my opinion, is staying from the top. All you gotta do, move the piping, the in, uh, intake manifold, obviously the throttle body, and that shit went to the side. And it literally, literally will be right there. You wanna disconnect your battery. Already did that. Okay, so I took off the intake manifold DS distorter. So it's about to rain, so I gotta hurry. Um, but yeah, so you have what actually holds up, holds the starter is just two bolts. It's this one right here, and you're just gonna remove obviously the nut. I don't have mine because it's pointless for me to have it. Uh, so you just remove the nut that's there. It's gonna, and then you're gonna move this uh, hard line, and you have a bolt literally right under it, right here. And this one right here is a 14. And so you're gonna obviously disconnect that because that's actually the one that goes to the battery. And then you have this literally just comes out. All right, I lied. Uh, another thing you have to do, like you see those two bolts right there that's holding up that bracket. Um, you're gonna have to remove those two. That way this can be free and I can, you know, actually have leeway to actually take this out. Because this is not budging at all. Guess what? Free! Old one is out. Yep. That's it. Now we're just gonna put that one in. Call it a day. And just like that, she's in. Look how clean and nice she is. So everything got put back together and battery's connected. Now let's see if she starts. That book bag though. We have power, lovely. Clutch in. Now we pray. Woo! On the first try. Yes! Now let's just hope that this doesn't happen again. I gotta get some gas, but I'm not. But we clean up this mess and I'm going home. As always, I appreciate you. Now, I don't. But do I know what I'm doing? No, but I'm gonna try because I like doing things with my hand and if I fail, I can always double back, you know what I mean? And learn from the mistake and then go back in and knock it out. And that's what you should do with life. There's a video showing you that these cars are not hard to work on. All right, till next time, peace.